Uh, hello and uh, welcome back everyone. Let's talk about array.from and array.includes methods. Okay, so I created an array. So array.include is uh, straightforward. Uh, sorry, I'm talking about array.from first. So this is like uh, you created. So array.from is actually a method to convert the, the collection elements into the array. So consider you just created one string, right? And now what you wanted to do, you wanted to split these characters into the array. So what you can do, array.from and pass this trgs. So what you will get, you will get an array of all these characters. and same as like this right so if your argument which you are passing is a uh, is uh, iterable then it convert that into the array so array dot from is a method to convert your variables convert your arguments into uh, the iterable array right it can be a collection of dom element it can be a collection of string it can be a collection of characters like string you are passing and you are getting array out of it Earlier, how we used to do it using ARGS dot, we used to do a split, split and then, so it, it used to give us the same kind of a result where you are doing, where you are getting the characters uh, array, right? Now you can just directly do that dot from, dot from is used for converting the, the iterable objects into the array, includes a uh, straightforward, uh, it is just uh, checking if that element is there or not. In the array right so here what it will check it will check array dot includes uh, six okay that is true it is there if you talk about uh, nine it's not there so obviously it is a false okay so these both the methods are important and we use it at different places it can be a string array where you have okay now you are checking hello then it will return true otherwise it will return false it will return false okay so that's it about both these methods 